When you think of Africa, what's the first thing that comes to mind? For me, it's got to be animals. I mean, just look at this place. Gorgeous, vast landscapes with so many different animal species making the most of their beautiful African home. Today, we're going to test your African animal knowledge. I'm going to give you some clues and then you have to try and guess what species I'm talking about. Now, I'm not going to make it too easy for you. Are you ready? Here we go. Clue number one. This animal is a herbivore, meaning they eat plants. Clue number two. This animal is a mammal, but it's one of the few mammals that cannot jump. And clue number three. This animal is the largest land mammal on Earth. Can you guess what it is? of course, one of Africa's most iconic species. These gentle giants consume about 220 pounds or 100 kilograms of vegetation a day. That's about 70,000 calories. When you hold the title of biggest land mammal on Earth, you need all the food you can get, right? A full-grown male African elephant can weigh the same as about three four-wheel drives. And understandably, that much weight can make it a little difficult to jump. Their legs just aren't strong enough to propel their heavy bodies upwards. And besides, an elephant doesn't need to jump. They're doing just fine with their elephant march. OK, are you ready for the next animal? Clue number one. This animal has four legs and four hooves. Clue number two. This animal only has to drink every couple of days. And clue number three. A group of these animals is called a tower. Can you guess what it is? It's a giraffe. Yep, the tallest land mammal on Earth. Notice that I didn't give you that fact as a clue? We didn't want to make it too easy for you. But like the elephant, these guys are herbivorous and they too consume a lot of vegetation each day. They love to eat the freshest, juiciest acacia leaves right at the top of the tree with the highest moisture content. So giraffes can go a long time without drinking. Giraffe are very social animals and are often found in groups of three to ten individuals. These groups are known as a tower. And I bet you can figure out how they got that name. All right, last one. Let's see how you go. Clue number one. This animal has six legs. Clue number two. This animal can move items up to 1,000 times heavier than its own body weight. And clue number three. This animal likes to eat poo. Yep, it's the one and only dung beetle. What an insect, such endurance and strength. These beetles usually work together in a male and female pair to move the dung balls for metres at a time. They love to eat the bits of undigested food left over in the poop. And the dung also makes great food for their offspring. I hope you managed to get three out of three on that one. If not, don't worry about it, because we'll see you next time on another round of Name That Species.